What is going on guys? Seed here with another FIFA 23 video and guys it is possibly the most satisfying FIFA 23 video on this RTG account guys and it all started with this 84 plus by 5 upgrade pack guys sit here Guys, I'm telling you right now, if you have not subscribed to this channel, you're going to want to hit that subscribe button. And uh, guys, if you aren't new to this RTG account, you know that we have been working up to the Ben Yedder uh, Player of the Month card. And we have been casually and steadily just climbing rivals. But guys, EA dropped these 84 plus by 5 upgrade SBCs. And that's where we start off this video. Guys, and I'm basically ad-libbing in post-processing. But guys, just strap yourselves in because you're going to see the most, I have to reiterate this, you're going to see the most satisfying uh, chain uh. of events. I tried to bring, I tried to clip in all of the relevant pieces of uh, recorded clips. So guys, if anything is missing, right? Um, in terms of like, trans for transparency's sake, it's just because there's a lot of like uh, recorded clips, just like assorted recording clips, and I've tried to like edit them all in. As you guys know, the editing process is kind of like the process that's the most frustrating sometimes in FIFA because there's a, there's a significant time gap that's not shown in, in between RTG videos uh, <laughs> specifically, right? Because it does take a long time to grind up to certain packs and whatnot, right? Especially when you're running an RTG. Not, not everything is as instantaneous as it may seem. Just nice editing. But guys, this took place as soon as the 84 plus by 5 SBCs were dropped. And as, as soon as you finish the head-to-head -head winning um, objectives, you get another 84 plus by 5, right? Which is absolutely brilliant, right? Because uh, it was repeatable, I want to say, by 3, right? So you have three 84 plus by 5s. And you have that additional one by completing the objectives, right? And it's just literally just winning in any game mode, right? So guys, I had, I, I've been sick, right? I've been out with a stomach virus and plus simultaneously I had a cold. And the cold is still lingering and I want to scream. But guys, uh, you are just going to see all the 84 plus by fives being opened, right? Uh, in a successive manner. Right, with minimal grinding, minimal, minimal grinding, right? Uh, just grinding in squad battles, just playing some friendlies, playing, uh, what's that first owner fiesta, right? Uh, you know, like, uh, you're, you're playing, you're playing all the modes that, that don't require as much energy, right? As, say, foot chance, for example, right? So everything is relative, of course, right? When we're speaking. So if we frame it in terms of like, uh, how difficult it was to grind up to these things, right? It's not that difficult. It's just time intensive, right? So we're getting the 84 plus by fives done, right? And as I'm um, getting the returns from the 84 plus by five SBCs, we're instantly submitting it into, right? The next 84 plus by five. And if you guys are paying attention to the video and not my words, you're gonna see everything happening in not real time, but, um in a successive manner. Like the events are straight through. It's a straight chain of events, right? It's just, there's a time gap, right? Uh, from the time these SBCs were dropped uh, to the time it got completed. And guys, it's just because it is a very time intensive process, right? For everyone who's not new to the RTG, right? Um, I mean, for everyone who's new to the RTG, excuse me, right? So yeah, we got the 84 plus by five and this one actually dropped the, the correct thumbnail, right? So I get to screenshot the thumbnail right there, right? But guys, it's just a, a huge, huge satisfying video. And uh, what do I want to say? Uh, I sound like Halle Berry right now, winning an Oscar, right? <laughs> so there's a reason why I'm so excited to bring this video to you guys, because the chain of events that led up to me getting the Ben Yedder and then um, getting that 87 plus uh, base or World Cup hero player pick pack that I promised you guys I would get done this week, right? If possible, right? Um, well, guys, because EA dropped that 84 plus by five, right, SBC, it made a whole chain of events possible, right? It made it much easier. Plus, there was the Future Stars Academy um, SBCs and the 78 plus player picks, right? So 
everything that you're seeing here it's 100 a pure rtg i need to hammer that home to you guys there's no money put in it's just time grind right the time grind right so guys as you see i just needed that final block to get finished right with the ben Yetter, right and as soon as i made it possible right as soon as it was as soon as it was possible with the with the pack pulls that i was getting you know i instantly went for it right i went for that ben Yetter because he has that five star weak foot and I wanted to pair him next to the Killian Mbappe, put my Storchkov, right? If you guys haven't seen the team, you're going to see what the team's looking like at some point in this video, right? It's just based on how we're editing it, right? But you guys are going to see it. Uh, uh, it was the last block that I had to complete. I I've been holding on to that block for like as long as possible it feels like right it feels like forever since we've gotten that block done right but i got the ben yetter done in the first match that i tried out with that ben yetter he had no impact <laughs> right but that's because i was just learning the card right learning the nuances of the card plus we are in division two so we do have like crazy uh crazy high tier players i, I mentioned this in the previous video high tier players god tier sides right so um he was shut down it's due to his physicality but the dribbling stats stand out on the Ben Yedder, right? The pace is acceptable for this stage in the game. The shooting stats are superb for this game. But it's the weak foot and the, uh, the five-star weak foot and the four-star skill moves that really make the Ben Yedder card a, a difficult opponent to play against. And that's a team of the year, Eder Militao card, guys. Eusebio. That's the second match, right? It took two matches to acclimate to the Ben Yedder card to, to, to get an understanding of how he moves. Sloichkov is on my left-handed side. Ben Yedder, first time shot. Boom, with the left foot, right? That's his weak foot. Takes it to the far side of the post. Guys, it's, there's nothing you can do. It's, 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 it's literally, he touches the, the first touch, you shoot, score, and then of course Mbappe with the strong foot on the as my right striker, and he takes in the second goal. Easy enough, right? I finished that match 4-2, uh, right? Um, against a really, really tough opponent with a god tier side, right? With a team of the year worthy side, but that, but that was the second match. So the first match um, ended, I think, in a draw, and this or a loss right one of those two i can't really remember it's this was like literally yesterday last night it was the last thing i did i was dead tired but guys once i got an understanding of how ben yetter worked i just left my division two as that right because i've been teetering and i was like hmm should i do more work or should i just keep it just stay in d2 and then finish it out right before the season right after we finish menu grinding and upgrading the squad but guys I, I, I promise you, this is going to be extremely satisfying because you know we've been hunting for specific players on this RTG account. We've been looking for specific, specific players, right? And my left back, I wanted to upgrade my left back. I wanted to put my Maldini back in it as one of my working starting center backs guys that was the mission all along to try to get Maldini right a fast fast medium high center back in my back line right and Maldini is one of them Sergio Ramos is a high medium I don't like those work rates but because his pure defensive defensive stats are so good in game and his build the build of the Ramos uh center back uh card that player is so wide in game and so aggressive in game and is so physical in game it makes up for a lot of the weaknesses in terms of the work rates right so um having desai um also in my squad is very very helpful right just in case i couldn't get the ramos um into the starting squad but uh, a pairing of maldini with another fast or really aggressive really big build like very strong center back is the ideal scenario uh at this stage in the fifa um 23 cycle so as you can see we're getting up to the next 84 plus by five as you can see here guys i've skipped no steps if you're paying attention to the video if you're watching the video you're in for a freaking treat right because we have the fantasy fut cards dropped i did pull the deli alley right um 
But would he make it into my side was one of the questions I started asking myself. Um, and then I had a lot of like live cards. The Guriri was done. I uh, had the Gordon done. Um, we're opening the rivals, right? Um, the division rivals, untradeables, right? Um, and we're doing whatever 78 pluses that we can do. We're doing any Future Stars Academy um, SBCs that we can do. Literally, I'm emptying out my club to bring this video to you guys, right? And those 84 plus by five SBCs are the game-changing SBCs that made this video possible, right? Because in the last video, we were comfortably climbing, right? Um, the only thing that we're prioritizing is the rivals climb, right? So we're gonna make it two to one. We're gonna do, <coughs> I have to cough again. But yeah, we're, 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 we have that easy jump from two to one and then one to elite will be the, the real test, right? Um, for the players, for, for my squad that I'm running, right? Um, at this stage in the game. Because it still is underpowered, right? But it's not too far removed from the team of the year-esque uh, side squads, right? The, God, the real God tier squads, right? So we're a little under, right? And one thing I want to give you guys as a side note, right? Um, I know that 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 Taram card, right? As you can see, we instantly jump into the. By the way, uh, if you're paying attention to the video, we instantly after the rivals climb, after we open start opening up the rivals pa uh, packs and whatnot, and uh, any duplicates, right? It just pushed me into the 87 plus player pick, the 87 plus base or FIFA World Cup hero player pick SBC, right? We just we just get that done and. Uh, any duplicates we automatically start working on 84 and 85 it is so reasonably priced right um, if you are playing the game you all you have to do is uh, grind a mode grind a couple modes right if you played rivals you should have enough in terms of like pack pulls right so eventually get it done within the time frame right all, all you have to do is play the game essentially right which is what you want right you want a grindable something that's feasible in terms of like just pure grinding pure grind work, right? That makes the game <coughs> pretty approachable, right? And it doesn't make, it doesn't require you putting in money into the game, uh, purchasing FIFA points or anything like that, right? Because that's not the aim of a pure RTG, of course. I gotta cough again. So yeah, guys, the stomach virus is gone, right? My energy levels are back up, as you can hear, but that cough is still lingering and I'm so annoyed. Just had some lemon and honey. But guys, I'm so amped up because when I tell you this is insanely satisfying, it is insanely satisfying to watch. Guys, I'm building it up. I'm building up the hype, right? Because if you guys have been following the RTG, you know I'm kind of giving away the game, right? But if you haven't been following the RTG, you know we're looking for one specific player. That's it. One specific player, right? Um, To help put Maldini as my center back, right? Which is what I want at this stage in the game, right? I want Maldini back in the center back in one of the center back spots, right? So we're looking for one specific player. And I, I pretty much, I think you guys, a lot of the FUT regulars are going to already know the player I'm searching for, right? So I'm not giving away the game, but you guys already know that there are only a couple ways that we can make that work, right? So um, in any case, we get the 85 side done. <sighs> wow, I gotta take a breather, <laughs> right? But yeah, guys, this is from the time period from when the 84 plus by fives were dropped to now, right? To present day, it is now. Uh, let's just check the date. Let me get my phone out. <laughs> you guys can update me too, right? So it is Thursday, March 9th. And it is 1226 when you are hearing me narrate this. So um, the all the Division 2 Rivals pack openings, the, the Rivals portion, for, right, from the Rivals time period, right, probably was about uh, like an hour and a half ago to two hours ago, right? Um, and then I did all the editing, and then I, I, I just... Uh, cleared out the club, right? Uh, I took a breather, cleared out the club, got rid of any consumables that I could have gotten rid of, any silver players, any, like, you, you know, like, just wipe the club completely, right? I did some Future Stars Academy upgrades, and I did some 78 plus player picks in between to get rid of duplicates and to get rid of the low rated fodder. I was gonna say, let me hold out for marquee matchups, but then I was like, what's the point, right? I'd rather do the, rather gamble with the player picks, right? And uh, lose the low rated fodder that way, right? Because why not? I would have a video to you guys on time, right? So that's essentially what, you know, so I'm working within the time frames of when things drop, right? And, um, 
uh, you, you know, you have to work within specific time frames for different SBCs and you don't want too much time to pass between SBCs before they just magically disappear out of your favorites, right? If you're not paying close attention, right? Uh, some of them uh, are repeatable, but some of them have different time frames, right? And sometimes it can be confusing, right? And I don't like, uh, you know, just like sitting on an SBC once I start an SBC. Uh, in this case, the 87 plus um, uh, base um, or FIFA World Cup Hero Player Pick uh, SBC. Once I started, I said, okay, we've got to finish it, right? Before before any weirdnesses, right? It, any misinterpretations happen, right? I just want to get it out the way. So we did all the 84 plus by fives. We also had that 184 plus by five from the objectives from w uh, doing uh, head to head uh, winning, right? So um, literally just did a whole bunch of squad battles, right? Just left the AI on amateur. That's the the easy and way to do. Are that finally right here. and it's just guys, a, a time uh, time tax essentially right but guys the 86 block is right here club. and guys and i think guys, i'm narrating I'm right now so getting let me not give away the game here I we go packed Eli Ali, uh probably like a day and a half ago and already i have to part ways with him felipe anderson um a little underrated for this stage in the game uh gordon and Bayi are two of my super subs, so I am unfortunately going to have to part ways with them, but it's not that big of a deal. Cleared out the club, there's nothing left, probably like 200, 300 coins, that's it. Everything that was tradable is out, and we are essentially starting with a clean slate um, going into the final days of the season, right? Um, so here we go. Um, we're gonna get a premium gold players pack back, but guys, likes, comments, subscription, notification bell, they all help keep the channel going. The toughest part of everything that we've done this week is going to be the editing that I have to do, right? Because we did a whole bunch of 84 plus uh, by fives, right? And um, uh, we opened up the rivals rewards, right? We stayed comfortably in division two. We'll do the remaining climb uh, literally now to the remaining days of the season. And, uh, yeah, guys, uh, that's that's going to be how the cookie crumbles. So this is essentially Captavia or bust, right? Because that's the player that I'm looking for. Any version of a Captavia card is a win. So that's what we're looking for, right? That's it. That's it. Anything. Th there's a couple other cards that would be uh, beneficial, right? Um, but the card that is ne a necessity in the side is Captavia, right? So we're going to send through these players, right? And uh, yeah, let's hope for something absolutely huge. Premium gold players pack back, but we've got the 87 plus base or FIFA World Cup hero player pick done, right? As promised. Guys, so I did everything I possibly could. So it's one of five, which is really good, right? It's an 87 plus, right? Should be like an 89 plus at this stage in the game, but an 87 plus with one of five, uh, I can see how, you know, it's 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 reasonably priced, right? Um. I, you can you can you you make that decision right uh we'll find out right now uh so here we go can we get captivia <sighs> yes 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 that's who we need this is how a gamble pays off, ladies and gentlemen. Yes! Yes! Whoo! Ha! Ha! Ha 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 When the gamble pays off like that. Oh! Woo! Oh! Ha ha ha! Guys! I look like a mad scientist right now. I have not cut my hair. I have not done anything. I have not shaved uh, since the last video to now. I've been sick. Guys, all of that just paid off in a big way. Guys, likes, comment, subscription, notification bell. They all help keep the channel going. Guys, I need 1,000 minimum subscribers. So if anything that you do today on this video right and if you liked any of my videos if you enjoyed even just a snippet of any of the videos in the whole catalog there's 500 plus videos now if you liked any of them thought any of them were interesting i need you to do me that one solid right you don't even have to click like just hit subscribe guys huh so i'll show you what the team's looking like now literally got ben yetter finished last night and now we have a new side Guys, this is going to be absolutely wild. Desai goes on the bench. 
Gordon, you are fun to use, my man, but ah, business is business and business is booming. Ah, I need a position modifier, but you guys know it's... Let's do that right now. Let's not waste any time. Whoo! Captavia is in the side. Any version of a Captavia card is an absolute win. It is one of the biggest pulls you could possibly get. And EA have knocked it out the park with that 87 plus uh, player pick. Oh my god. That is how you win big. Ah, that's a high risk, high reward set of moves that I did. Um, with every 84 plus by five, with everything I had to send through in the club, that's literally everything, right? Like I had to send through almost everything. There's literally nothing in terms of fodder remaining, but that's the biggest win I could have possibly, that's a big one of the biggest wins uh, I've gotten on this channel without doing an insane, insurmountable amount of work, right? Who? Boy, oh boy, that's a big win. Uh, and guys, you know how frustrated I've been on the channel to get specific players. Uh, and that is a highly specific player that we need. Obviously, there's an 89 version of the card, but that's not our concern. Look at the price of, that eight, of the 89. Obviously, that's understandable, right? But let's look at the World Cup Hero version of the card. What is still going for? Guys, that is still a huge, huge W. Gah! Guys, leave some love on the channel. I got to do a whole bunch of editing to show you how I got up to that point. But guys, it's all transparent. It's all 100% a pure RTG. And that's how you win, right, on a pure RTG. So I've got six days to hit Elite. And we can essentially start playing other games, right? We can essentially start doing that. But now, because we've done that, because we have done that, right, we have pulled up huge we can pair ramos with uh maldini and captavia we just need to put a shadow on him and he is good to go oh and that left back side is soft we can start working on the right back side and now like with the two paired up top i've only played i think two games with ben Yedder. i want to see if it's two I'll let you know right now. Yeah, two only one goal scored one assist but guys i'm learning the card and the card is just you know, it's 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 so really good even at this stage of the game and 89 is still worth it and Storchkov over on the left wing side. That's how we started using him and that's how we can use him again going forward, right? So the midfielders we can prop up in the future and that right back, but guys, that back line is starting to come together, right? And the whole team is on full cam and uh we're we're down a couple players in in terms of subs, but phew, that's a W if ever there was a W. Guys, uh, I've got my work cut out for me in terms of building a super sub, a, a, a super sub worthy bench. But guys, that's an epic W. Uh, I think you guys know that's a W. So guys, leave some love on the channel. Likes, comments, subscription, notification bell. They all help keep the channel going. Peace, love, all the blessings to you and yours. Sid out. Yeah.